and do the same thing. And you want to get real fancy? All right, let's take it to a, one more step now. With this hand, I want you to go like this. All right, accent a little harder on the first of the one and two and three and four, and one and two and three and four. As you go through it and you're on three of it, I want you to take this part of your hand and smack it down a little bit, almost like you're making a, a beat, where the one is a kick, and that's the snare on the three. And add that to everything that you're doing here. So you got. So you just want to keep making the rhythm more rhythmic with your body, you know? So yeah, cool, yay, nice, aha. Uh -huh. Okay, that's actually another song that goes through the whole rhythm thing. Doing the and kind of hitting it down to give it more of the And it's using all of those things that we talked about, stopping the notes and giving it a little, a little drum beat here. If you don't do that, all you end up with is. And that just doesn't feel like enough, you know, so. Do the same thing when the chords kick in. The solo. All right. What the hell did I do for that fucking solo? And why do I make solos that are so damn ridiculous that I don't even know what I did after I did it? And then I gotta figure out what I play for you guys. Uh, shit. All right. Let me think about this. I know it started off with. A bend, uh, starting off real high up on the 22nd and just taking it to the high there and just and bringing it down. And you want to get a little bit of extra shit in there and then let it go so that you need that tension. You need other notes in there with it like that as you bend because it's got to clash, it's got to hurt a little bit when it's going through all the, the gritty little saturation tube things in the amp. So. Kind of like that. And then it goes into a, what is it? A pentatonic minor E scale. These are the notes. More volume. And here's what I do with it. I pick like that, and then I go here. Picking of that though, here's the thing. Every time I'm switching strings and I'm heading up, I'm going an up to an up or a down to a down. So instead of going down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, I'm going down, up, down, up, down, down, up, up, like that. It's just one less movement and you can just kind of glide it a little bit. Uh, then down, up, down, down, see. Wait, I'm starting to remember, hang on. Okay. That's what happens first. I remembered. Cool. Okay. Watch the picking. Right there. Same thing here. Move it down one. Here. Up and up. There. Down. Like that. I can't do it fast. It's gonna suck. But let me take it a little bit faster. Mm. 
think I did it a little different, but you get the idea. So that is a uh, little picking exercise that we can start with uh, based on that solo. Take a scale. You know that scale. Then we're gonna take it to these notes. And we're gonna go like this. It's gonna go down, up, down, up, and then when we're going in between the strings, down, down, up, up. And then going this way, down, up, down, up, down, down, up, down, down. Like that. So sloppy, it sucks. That's why you gotta practice it. So that is the little picking exercise that I want you all to try and get down. Yeah. So the solo starts with that. You got the uh, your nasty, crying out, painful bend, and then it jumps into. Uh, went to a a little uh, B arpeggio B major and it jumps up to another E minor blue uh, pentatonic thing skipping around so yeah to that and then it went I think to a little fingery and to then and I flip this real quick. Uh, need more drive to really get it out. Just a lot of stupid noises. Uh, goes into. I'm using this thing. I should explain what I do with this. Try and edit out all my like bullshit yapping in between stuff, man, because it's just going to kill people. A um, little bit about this thing. When you're on the neck pickup, now the pickup really only picks up the sound before it to there. It doesn't pick up the sound after it. Uh, example of what I'm talking about. Notes, notes, notes are gone. So. What I do with this is I use it to sort of, as if I was moving the bridge this way. I go like that. You can only get that with this. Uh, if you do it with this pickup, you're only gonna have this much room to make that happen. Not much, as opposed to. So. That's how that works. So at that point, I was flipping up to here, and I went up to, and I kind of, and I think I did a, uh, what was it? I'm trying to remember this shit, like, with the camera on. It sucks, man. Uh, something like that. Something like that. I don't know, you know, I only practice my shit when I got a tour, otherwise I try and forget it and just think about other things. Cause like after you spend nine months in the studio working on the stuff, the last thing you wanna do is play it again. So, but anyway, uh, for the purpose of showing you people, you know, what the hell I'm doing. Uh, yeah, so. picking like that. 